Guys, meteorologist Joe Fury in the Storm Team 8 Weather Center. Well, here we are now with a change in the weather after having a solid week of solidly frozen conditions out there. Uh, we're now going into, well, wet and warmer. We do have a round of snow overnight tonight. It ends uh, by around dawn uh, on Wednesday. And you're talking about a coating to an inch or two, just enough to make it slippery for the morning commute on Wednesday, especially across the interior. So, yes, putting it to Gill and Alyssa first thing on Wednesday morning for the latest update, it's not a big deal, but it's enough to maybe cause some school delays. As uh, during the day Wednesday, there's really not a whole lot going on. It'll be going into Wednesday night. In the first half of Thursday, we got a swath of steadier and heavier rain as temperatures are on the rise and spring is in the air for late Thursday and Friday when it's mainly dry. And then a storm over the weekend is going to be interesting. We're right on the edge of the snow and ice. And then you go, you know, northwest Connecticut, Berkshires, Poconos, Catskills. There could be a real decent snowstorm going on there. So stay tuned on Saturday night and Sunday. And then going into February, it uh, looks like temperatures want to stay above average uh, for a while at least. So for now, let's talk about what's happening to uh, start your Wednesday, a winter weather advisory for most of the state with the exception of the shoreline. Coating to an inch or two, just enough to make it slick as we head through the early morning hours of Wednesday. You can see how by 630 in the morning, the snow's done. So that's good and rapidly improving conditions across the region. Again, you guys on the shoreline are mainly wet. It's the interior, especially as you go up in elevation. Uh, that's when you're going to have the, uh, the slick conditions. But during the day, Wednesday, it's just cloudy. Temperatures, uh, 30s inland, low 40s at the coast. There'll be a few scattered showers around. But, but again, during the daylight hours Wednesday, it's really not doing much. By evening, by the time the sun goes down, the steady rain is in. Rain Wednesday night into Thursday morning look at those 40s thursday morning so half an inch or more of rain there are signs that the rain ends by noontime on thursday that would be nice for a 50 degree mainly dry thursday afternoon with a few showers around how about in the 50s for a fantastic spring like friday mainly dry and then saturday maybe some early sun cloudy here comes the next storm rain arrives overnight saturday night and uh, rain on sunday but Northwestern Connecticut, Western Massachusetts, and points on west, it could be a real mess, snow and ice. So we've got to figure out the Saturday night, Sunday routine may change to snow everywhere going into Sunday night and early Monday. So uh, again, uh, uh, that's a big snowstorm for our friends just out to the west of us. It's uh, coating to an inch or two, maybe in the high elevations, ending by dawn. Could be slippery conditions in places away from the shore to start your Wednesday. Otherwise, it's uh, mostly cloudy with a spotty shower. And then the steady rain Thursday night and Friday morning. No, Wednesday night and Thursday morning, Thursday afternoon and Friday are very nice with temperatures up 50 or higher. And then Saturday looks like the dry day of the weekend, Saturday night and Sunday. Rain, you know, it's, it's, this could be one of these I-84 south and east rain deals north and west. Yeah, that could be a whole different story. Uh, so we'll just say stay tuned on the, the weekend event. Uh, for now, stay tuned to Gil and Alyssa. First thing on Wednesday morning for any potential school delays and, and road problems. And I hope you're feeling well. Bye.